We've been waiting for all the angles, and now we have all the angles. Good afternoon, everyone. Gianni O from the Plot Hole, and today we have it. We have the CCTV footage fresh from the internal investigations of the Mokoleto Police Department in Washington, which is where I was supposed to be. That's why you're getting Avatar, Johnny, and not the real deal. All my camera equipment is packed up. Anywho, let's dive right into the action. I want to start with a bit of video that brought all of this to a head. Take a look at Glenn here. The officer later states that he felt that Glenn had a firearm. What do you think? Is this a movement that causes concern? I think so. Hands out your pockets. Hands out your pockets. Hands out your pockets. Glenn, you listen. This is what happens when you play fuck around and find out. I'm not doing that. You're under arrest. Listen, listen. Oh, don't. Don't mess around. I wasn't told not to come here. We'll advise you of your rights in a minute. Mr. 400 level English strikes again. I wasn't doing nothing. Who doesn't like a good arrest video when it involves this guy? I think even the frauditors are secretly applauding this one. Hang on one more second. I wasn't seen in the lobby or anything. How's that? Is that okay for you? Six section forty one. What code for? You can open here. One in custody. I wasn't told to leave the property. Ever. What? They didn't tell him to leave the property? Say it ain't so. There goes their whole case. Hey, explain everything to you. Just one sec here. I don't know what you're explaining. Oh, look how nice these officers are being to Tubatelli here. I say tighten them up a notch or two. What's this? Out of the street. Yep, sidewalk's fine. Sidewalk's fine. Out of the street, please. If that's your car, that's not a parking spot, it's a lane of travel. Okay. I don't know if you know who that is. There they go, they're going. Do you have any weapons on you? Nope. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna pat you down real quick. We'll do a search in just a second. I'll read some stuff to you. Oh. Whoa. Oh, I forgot they have to do a search. I feel bad for that officer. I wonder if he's a rookie or just drew the short straw. <clears throat> what am I being arrested for? So right now you're under arrest for felony harassment. What do you mean, felony harassment? I'll explain everything to you in just a second. You mean they didn't have to ask you to leave to arrest you? Aww. We can walk through there, yeah. Do you want to open the gate? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Do you want to grab the car and so we can open the gate here? Sure, so why don't we walk up in there? We'll go ahead inside and do a search. Get him in a transport car. How am I being arrested for felony harassment when I haven't done nothing wrong? I know you keep saying that, but. Talk to this gentleman real quick. 
Uh, is that the Glenn Waddle of shame? I think it is. There's a lot here, so let's skip ahead. Officer Ball calls for a different car to transport because she doesn't want to spend the next year scrubbing the interior of her cruiser. Well, this this will work fine. I will just stay right over here for me. Um, maybe you just grab me a property bag. I'll get it searched real quick. Yeah. It's ready for you to park. Anything on you that looks like I have nothing. I have nothing. Yeah. Pants? Looks more like Glenn hollowed out a seal and plashed them onto his skin. Probably not. Not yet. Sorry, I can take a back now. We'll put this in evidence. Reckless or anything like that. What's that? You wear a necklace. No. Does it look like it? Mm -hmm. I'm just asking. I know, but you're asking a lot of pretty redundant questions. I mean, not trying to be an asshole, but you can clearly see I'm not wearing it. I'm going to use the back of my hand to search your crotch area. Oh, ew, ew, ew. Somebody definitely lost a straw draw. Thanks, bud. Anything else on you that I missed? This is no. We're going to switch up our Unless you guys plant something. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to read this to you right now. You have the right to remain silent. You can be safe and use against you in a court of law. You have the right at this time to talk to a lawyer and have him present with you while you're being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you for questioning if you wish. You can decide at any time to exercise these rights and not answer any questions or make any mistakes. Do you understand each of these rights I've explained to you? No, because my lawyer is not present when you said you'd read the rights. So you said I have the right to have my lawyer present. He's not present. Before questioning. I can, can I read them to you again, maybe? But, I'll read them again. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can be used against you in a court of law. You have the right at this time to talk to a lawyer and have him present with you while you are being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you before questioning if you wish. You can decide at any time to exercise these rights and not answer any questions or make any statements. Do you understand each of these rights I have explained to you? I guess. Okay. Having these rights in mind, do you wish to talk to us now? Uh, if you tell me what's going on, sure. Okay. So He's told you, I think, four times now. You've been arrested for felony harassment. Keep up with the conversation. Now this is where the officer offers some explanation of why Glenn's being arrested. Lawyers, let me know down in the comments section if you agree or disagree. Right now you're under arrest for felony harassment. For who? Um, for some actions that you just did when I was coming through the gate right there. I'm confused. What do you What do you mean? Well, you took your hand out of your pocket and like moved it towards my facial. Really no, that's not true. Well, th that's what happened. No, that's okay. not. So I'm, I'm just telling you that's what you're under arrest. Okay, well, I mean, you can, I didn't do nothing to you. I don't have nothing. So, I mean, you can, you know. Okay, well, that's why that's why you're under arrest for felony harassment. Uh, it doesn't, it's not going to stick. You, you, I didn't harass you. How did I harass you? Okay, well, I, I was worried that you had a gun in your hand. No, come on. Uh, oh, come on. 
So, so you can absolutely talk to a judge about that. And you'll have an opportunity to do that in the morning, maybe today, but most likely in the morning. Do you, do you have any other questions for us right now? You're saying I had a gun. I'm not saying that. Is I that on? I didn't. I didn't know mm -hmm. if you had a gun. You are being audio. You're saying I had a gun. Nope. And, and I didn't say that. You're saying that. No, no. You said you said I was worried. You had a gun. That's what I said. That's what you said, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, do you have any questions for me right now? Who wants to make a bet that this next question is nonsensical? Uh, my name is Rieger. I don't even know who you are. Okay. All I was doing is standing on the island. Okay. Well, I was worried for my life. Oh, come on. And I would like to remind oh. you, sir, you did tell us two times that you were going to buy a firearm. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm going to buy a firearm. Yeah, okay. Well, the last time you heard, that's what you said. I don't remember that. Two okay. different officers. It's, it's, it's on the recording video. inside the PD. I don't know. Yeah, I'm holding the phone, okay? So. Okay, not with the hand you took out of your pocket. Do you have any other questions for us right now before you head up to jail? I took my hand out of my phone, and that says I'm holding a weapon? Come on, Glenn. That's below even your level of spin and bullshit. No, you, you're not saying what I said. I don't, I'm not sure what you're saying. I'm saying that if you think I took my hand out of my pocket, maybe my hand came out. It's normal. In and out, you know? I don't... Okay. Well, we're going we're gonna to write a search warrant for the video on your phone, and um, that will likely show what happened out there. Okay. Well, I mean... Any other questions for us right now? Um, <clears throat> I would like to speak to my lawyer. Okay, uh, you have an, absolutely have an opportunity to do that, Jim. No, that, that didn't happen last time. I was put in a cell for 12 hours. Okay, we're, we're not going to... I'm not asking you any questions about what happened. I'm just telling you what's going on. Right, but you know you're wrong. No. Okay, I mean, if that's how you feel. No, it, it's the, not how I feel. It's just what I haven't happened. done nothing to you. Okay. All, all I did was stand behind the gate. That's all I did. Okay. Uh, do you have any questions I'm before you get in the car? Uh, I think it's my car. Uh, my, my I would like to... Oh. Why don't you just write me a oh, citation? Because I, mean, I right. have a, I a job to go to on Monday. So. Go, my work is done. I got to go back. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What you got to do? I thought you was going to help me out. Uh, look, look here, my, I've been thinking, okay? Now, with the kind of work that I do, right, I think it's really important that I'm not seen on TV. Tommy. What? Everybody in the audience knows damn well you ain't got no job, man. Okay, I, I can't Sorry, you got the car. Phone, and uh, it's just, I'm just transporting. Come on, yeah, man. It doesn't phone. have to. So I'm just dropping this off. Yeah, so let's get him in the car. Because... Uh, I'm going to have you... You're right, Glenn. This is stupid. Now that you've identified the problem, the second step is solving it. This is where I'm going to leave this one. I've left plenty on the bone for my fellow criticizers of Glenn. So, don't forget your plot hole, pal. At the end of the day, this is where we all knew Glenn would end up. In jail for stupid shit. Folks, if you want to inspire change, don't do what this guy does, because the only thing that gets changed is Glenn's lockup uniform. And that's our show. If you enjoyed yourself, hit that like button and wait to the next video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so, and slap that bell like whoever should have slapped Glenn Serio when he was a child so you don't miss an episode. I want to send a special shout out to all my channel members and patrons. Your continued support means the world to me. As always, I'm Johnny O, and it's time for everyone's favorite finger guns, baby.